hi guys welcome back to my channel and happy mother's day to all the lovely mothers that are watching my channel actually mother's day was yesterday sunday um anyway so i want to um show you guys what i found i have a lot of stuff i'm so excited to show you guys um i don't know if i should do like a part two um just so i won't make this video so long i'm not sure yet we'll see if we can squeeze everything and i don't talk so much so i'm not gonna hold you guys up i'm gonna go straight to it and i'm just gonna grab in no particular order okay so the first thing i have right in front of me is this um clorox um bottle i got this at an estate sale i've always been wanting one it's actually not this one that i'm looking for the one that i want has like a little handle and it's a little bigger but when i saw this one i was like i'll just start my little collection so i grabbed this one i believe this was um three dollars so i grabbed this one um i just need to clean it it's a little dirty inside but it's really cool for my laundry room i also got another one of these um brooms this was one dollar i picked this up at a yard sale they were antique um they had an antique shop so and but they were getting rid of everything i guess their business they were gonna close their business so they have like their tags of what this this was priced at $12 originally, but I got it for three. And it's the same one that I got um, in my last haul. It's just a little bigger and this one does have a seal on it. So I grabbed another one of these. She was um, getting rid of all of the things in her um, shop, bringing them to a yard sale so she couldn't sell them. Alrighty, another thing that I got are these napkins. They're so nice. They're really pretty. They have a nice design. And they're all really nice and clean. Um, I believe these were um, $2. No, they were $2 a piece. But, like, this one by itself was $9 at her shop. When she was selling them, $9. I got it for two. This one was 18. I got it for two. And this one doesn't have a sticker. But I grabbed those three for two dollars a piece. <clears throat> With her, we're still in her yard sale. So I, I was I was in heaven. I was I didn't want to leave, but um, I also grabbed this um, honey. What is this called? Can you guys tell me what this is called? It's a little... Um, I was looking for a smaller one, but this one's a, a bigger one. It's also nice. I think this was a dollar. I grabbed two um, hankies. Is that what they're called? Hankies. I love the print. This is one of them. And this is another. I actually grabbed them um, because I like to fold these. Fold them, fold them. Let me see. And then use them in my hair. Like, I'll tie it off. So I'll use them in my hair. And I liked these too. These were um, two for a dollar. At first, I was like, why do I need so many? And now she told me she was going to have another yard sale um, in a couple of weeks. So I'm going to definitely go again and try to get some more stuff. Because I did regret a few things that I didn't grab. I was like, I should have just picked it up. And she was so cheap too. So next time I'm, I go, I'm going to grab some more. But it's these two. They're really pretty. Okay, what else did I get from her? Okay, I guess it's just these last two things that I grabbed from her. And it's this little cute um, bear with his bare little slippers for Christmas. I grabbed him. 
Then I also got this um, Santa. I liked this back. He has little elves in there with the letters coming out of the chimney. That was pretty nice. I actually found a few more things I found from her and it was this um, vintage, um, what is this? A compact and lipstick duo. I thought it was so neat. It's from um, Dorothy Gray. Obviously I'm not gonna use it. This one in her booth was um, originally $36. You can't really see it, but it's right there. She was asking $36 and I got it for $3. And then this apron, it's from the 1940s. I love the color. really pretty and this one was um, two dollars I got another one it's a strawberry one it's a little different this one was also two dollars and then the last thing I got from her was this um, faded glory um, the sweater it still has a tags on it but i think this is from like um i got it for like winter when it's cold and it's super soft inside like it has a really soft material and i got this for me um this was only um a dollar so if you guys know anything about this one or the year, I don't know. I thought it was an old, it looks like an older sweater, but I'm not sure. Um, that was it for that yard sale that I went to. Um, now I'm going to show you um, what I got at an estate sale. And it's this little, got a little pot. It was only... Five dollars. I also got this at an estate sale. I love Harry Potter. <laughs> the little flower print. That's the brand. I picked up this basket. It's nice and sturdy. Picked up another basket also nice and sturdy across um from the lady that was having the yard sale with all the aprons and all the goodies um there was another lady having a yard sale and i found this print sorry you guys i found this print i just thought she looked really nice um i may change this um frame to like a nice thicker one and it was only um 50 cents so I like that one it's like a little moody the colors it's like a little darker I like that one and then on my last video I showed you guys the um, washboard with the glass on it and I found this one this is the one that I was like originally looking for and I found another one which I don't mind finding another one and I got this one for three dollars as well so i have another one for my collection the state sale and i found this one i wanted to i've been looking for like a picture for my nightstand so i won't have to get up at night and get water i found this one this is this i found this one and then in here you put ice so it won't your drink or whatever you have in here won't dilute it so you put the ice in here to keep it cold but i'm just gonna have water in there so. and i got this one for eight dollars 
I did some research and this one um, says that it's from the 1960s. I got it for $8. And I thought this was really pretty. I picked this up at a that same estate sale. It's just like a tissue, a tissue holder. This was $3. It has a pretty little butterflies. I picked up this um, brass. It has the little hooks on there. That's a really pretty detail. It's really nice. It's brass. It says made in India. And I think I'm gonna put this in my restroom to hang um, like little towels to dry your hands. I think that's where I'm gonna put it. I know it's not Christmas, but when it's this is the time where you get stuff. I got this little tree for two dollars. It does actually light up. It works. Got this one. I wonder if I showed you guys this frame, but I um this one was from a previous haul, and it's this little Christmas um embroidered frame. I think it's just really cute. I got the little back. It's so pretty. That's a lot of nice detail. So I got this frame from an estate sale I picked up this um, lamp I haven't actually put a bulb in here and see if it works but it's this one I thought this one was really pretty I just need to clean it up and this was five dollars I picked these boxes up because I think these are just good um, all year round to layer or for Christmas. There's three of them. They're pretty, pretty nice. And then at that yard sale, I picked this up and I was, I had never seen anything like this. It's this big lantern um, thing. I don't know what it's called, but this, I plan to decorate with this. Oh, and one more thing um, for the lady of the the she already she's she already has a name, but the lady the that I went to the yard sale to, that um, she was selling her things from her booth. Um, I picked up this bag, and this was um, $1. So this is also pretty to hang, like on a peg rail. These up, too. I just thought they were... What I am going to use are these. Um, these um, stainless steel spatula spoons. They are... Um, stainless steel. They all are stainless steel. And they were only a dollar each. I was actually forgetting the the items that are that I'm most excited about, which is this. I found this at an estate sale. It's this um print it's this frame and usually I'm not into fruit like I'm not a fruit person but I just really liked the colors on this one I love this vase I just like the colors and also um I don't know if you guys um if you guys don't you guys should um I watch McKenna she has amazing videos and she's been thrifting um and asking her mom to make like a, uh, to paint um, something like this for her. So when I found this, um, I did pay $15 for this, but honestly, I liked it. So I purchased it for $15, which is probably not a lot, but I usually like to keep things super inexpensive. I'm gonna take you over here. My husband um, brought, bought these for me. 
is this this one it's super big but I just love the little girl you know feeding the birds I love this frame and then it has um, I'm gonna bring you guys closer Do you guys see that crease that crazing on that picture? It's so neat. It's so cute. This is the one I'm most excited about. It's huge. It has that flower arrangement. It has butterflies. I love butterflies. I love the colors. It also has um, crazy. I don't know if that's like part of the picture or if it, with age, I'm not sure. If you guys know, let me know. Um, the frame, I did want to um, make it a little, just a little darker, like a little dark gold. So if you guys know um, what I can use to do that, let me know. I'm so excited with all my finds. Um, I can't wait to decorate. I can't wait to show you guys where I put my stuff. And um, and that's it. I'm just um, excited for everything I found. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, for all your nice comments. Everybody's so nice here on my channel. Thank you guys so much. And if you guys know, I'm not, you know, I'm not an expert. I don't know where um when things are from or anything so if you guys do know if you guys see something that i have and you guys know about it let me know um i love to get information um yeah that's it thank you guys for coming back to my channel and um i hope to make more videos for you guys i'll see you guys on the next one bye good morning guys welcome no wait so well, it's morning for me but not for you well maybe not